My name is Karin Darabidian. I opened KDMMA in October of 2018. I started with karate. I trained in karate, I got a black belt in karate. Then I did Taekwondo. I got a black belt in Taekwondo. Slowly I got into kickboxing and boxing. I did a bunch of amateur fights in boxing and kickboxing. I started doing Judo and Jiu Jitsu. I got my black belts in both. After doing all of these for so long, I started putting everything together. Since I knew how to strike, I knew how to grapple, I knew how to stand up and wrestle, everything came together and I started doing MMA. There's nothing like an MMA fight. You feel the most alive when you're in that cage and you're locked up in that cage when there's you and your opponent. Nobody can really help you. It's all on you to go step in that cage, try to win, you know? So I don't think there's any, any feeling like that. 50% is physical, the other 50 you have to be mentally prepared, especially at the high level. The winning edge is that mental preparation. If you're not mentally there, you're not gonna be able to win these high level fights. So meditation plays a big role in and conditioning the mind to tap into that place where when your body realizes that it's done, your mind tells it to keep going because the mind will quit a lot sooner than the body will. The body will keep going. Uh, ask me over here. This over here is my sensei, Goku Chavichin. I've been training with Sensei Gokor since I was 13 years old uh, and I still train with him. I'm a highest on grappling black belt, judo black belt under Sensei Gokor. Anybody that does MMA has to really love the sport. It's got to be a passion. If you're doing it for fighting, for the money, uh, you're not going to be making money in the beginning. It'll take some time for you to build a name, get up to the bigger promotions, then you'll start seeing money. You always have to remind yourself that I'm ready for this. I need to keep going. And, and the body will always keep going as long as you're mentally there and you prepare for it. I, I get the most gratitude when I help people out and, I, and I, see, I see them changing. It gives me a different happiness that nothing can buy.